Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for joining me today. I want to talk about Peter Warlock and I'm doing this because Mexi Mex asked me to do it. Mexi has been a great friend to me. He's been a great friend to this vlog. If you look at any of the comments over the last year or so, two years, uh, you'll see a link to Mexi's group down there. Uh, he has been just a tremendous supporter and I'm so delighted that he asked me to do this. He said, you know what, I think I was doing a review of uh, the Walter Jeans book, Illusioneer by Peter Warlock. And, uh, and Mexi commented down below, he said, you know, you really ought to do a vlog on Peter Warlock. He was quite an amazing person, an amazing entertainer, an amazing writer, historian, and that he was. So, Mexi, Peter Warlock. Peter Warlock was born June 23rd. 1904 in London, England. He crossed over December 16th, 1995 at the ripe young age of 91. He was born Alec William Bell. Changed his name to, to Peter Warlock. Publisher of the Pentagram from 1946 to 1959 and the new Pentagram from 1969 to 1989. He also wrote a column in Magic Graham served as the editor of the Gen. 1960, he became the honorary president of the Paisley Magic Circle. Peter Warlock became honorary life president of the Blackpool Magicians Club. In 1952, he was awarded the IBM's British Ring Shield. His magician daughter, Elizabeth Warlock, won the award in 1953. His contributions and inventions include Silk Filter, 1947, Atomic Silk, 1948, Cream the Jester, 1949, Out of the Loop, 1952, Self-Contained Milk Pitcher, 1952, Ring and Rope Release in the Tarbell Course of Magic, Volume 6, 1954, Adhesive Glass, 1955, Ring Cord, 1959, Double Deck Deception, 1959, Diablo Deception, 1959, Thought of Cards Across and Di Vernon's Ultimate Secrets of Card Magic by Lewis Ganson, 1967. Giant Size Triple Tubes, 1972. His books include Designs for Magic, 1941. Plans for Deception, 1942. The Best Tricks with Slates, 1942. Patterns for Psychics, 1947. Peter Warlock's Book of Magic, 1956. Warlock's Way, 1966. Black Art Well Tricks for the 1980s. Magician Pseudonyms, 1980. Uh, the Magic of Pavel, 1981. Then he wrote, he wrote for the Mike Caveney series. Uh, these are all magical publications. This is Walter Jean's Illusioneer. I spoke about this in another vlog. This is a book on P.T. Selbeck, folks. P.T. Selbeck, Magical Inventor by Eric Lewis and Peter Warlock. Alt, fantastic biography. Watir de Colta, Genius of Illusion by Peter Warlock. Fantastic. These are all limited edition. This particular one, de Colta, is number 923 of 1,000. It was absolutely fantastic. All of his writing, I'll tell you what, uh, uh, Peter Warlock is one genius of a historian. Uh, I don't know if these books are still available or not. I know that uh, Walter Jeans has been reissued. You should be able to get that. Uh, likely, Mike Cavity might still have copies of these around. If not, you can probably find them on eBay. Uh, highly recommend them. The Complete Book of Magic by Peter Warlock. It's, um, as you might expect, you know, it's a basic, simple uh, beginner book of magic, not really beginner, I mean there's, there's some there's some great material in here. Uh, so I highly recommend that to you as well. Mexi, thank you so much for asking for this, I hope you enjoyed it. I know it's brief, brief overview of who Peter Warlock was, but hey, you know that's what my purpose is here, to, to, to let you know about people you might not know about, to give you a sense for what their contribution was, and encourage you to go out and look for yourself. Go out and buy the books, read the books. Um, enjoy. Enjoy. 
Thank you so much for joining me. Please subscribe down below if you've not done so already. Please comment. I love your comments. This, by the way, presentation was done for Mexi because he commented. Uh, thank you so much. I will see you next time.